We got a 98 Ford Explorer, Eddie Bauer. Customer called me, want me to tell him how much I charge to put his transmission in for him. I gave him a price and everything, and he said, okay. Well, he goes and tells me he's had two people, two people, try to get this transmission in, and they say they can't get it in. He says, the last person says, oh, it's bolted up and it's almost ready to go. Well, you know that's a lie. It got towed to me yesterday and I jacked it up and this is what I found, okay? What is, what is this shit right here? What, what is this? The transmission, they said the transmission's lined up. You know we're near lined up. Your um, separator plate right here needs to be on there. If this is not on there, you're going to fuck the transmission up. Alright? What I don't understand is, why, why did they start hooking, they start hooking everything up. They start hooking everything up to this transmission. Wires, like pretty much every wire. Even over here, the cooling lines, they hooked the cooling lines up and everything. And why did they, uh, well, I just don't understand this. Like, this what, this what I see right here that people don't know what the hell they're doing. Okay? Like, why is the drive shaft still in it? Both drive shafts are still in it. And they're still, and they're, they put a the mission in. So, feel free to comment and you tell me what these people have done. Because this shit is what I don't freaking do. The first thing I would have done was take both of these drive shafts out get them out of the way. Okay? Even going back up in it, I wouldn't even hook this shit up. This shit is last. Oh, I, I, oh, I almost forgot. Going back up, well, whatever the hell they was doing. They come over here... They took the radiator out of it. They took the radiator out of it because they scared this fan was going to hit the radiator. These people are crazy. So, anyways, <laughs> hold on one second. Anyways, like I said, I don't understand why people try to work on their own shit or hire other people that don't know what the hell they're doing because this is what you end up getting so uh, they said they got two bolts in it only thing i see is one bolt but i want to take i want to take this transmission completely out again take all this drive shaft crap out of my way because i don't know what they was thinking right here and i gotta check and see they didn't bust the pump because the darn the talking bottle, it's smashed up against the darn flywheel. The studs they even lined up to it. So, if this person would have took this thing to a regular shop, they probably would have charged him about $3,000. Me, I'm helping this guy out. I'm charging him $600. But, I'm fixing to call him and we're fixing to go up an extra couple hundred. Because the simple fact is, it's been sitting for two years. And every Ford I've ever seen that sits for two years, we're going to need to put a fuel pump in it probably. But we'll worry about that later. But anyways, if y'all need anything, hit me up at Ben's Auto Repair.